Hello folks, my name is Raido Boost and it's time to take a deeper look into AutoCAD 2017 update 2017.1 and especially talk about PDF import new features. As I showed before, you can visually see to where new features has been added. If I go to my insert tab, I can see highlights at import tab. So those new features are included with the latest update. First of all, to walk you through what is changed in terms of PDF import, I have created a simple PDF from AutoCAD drawing. It includes several texts with different styles, like TXT, Simplex and Verdana. I close this PDF now. And back to AutoCAD, I have created one new empty AutoCAD drawing. And first, I check my text styles from Annotate and open up my text style dialog. As you see, this empty drawing currently includes only standard that uses Arial and annotative that also use Arial font. I close my dialog. I now import new PDF into my empty AutoCAD drawing. For that, I go to Insert tab and use Tool PDF Import. Of course, you can start by using a touch command and to conversion later on. But right now I use PDF import. I then select my PDF files that I want to import and open. If your PDF includes multiple pages, you have to select which page you want to import. Currently, I have only one page PDF. I want to ensure that true type text is selected. I now hit OK. I can see that my Verdana text is directly converted into AutoCAD text objects. Also, if I check my text style again, annotate and textile dialog, I can see that because during PDF import my true type fonts were converted, also new textiles are automatically generated. PDF Verdana that uses the same font as in the original drawing. I hit cancel right now. If this text should be in one text area, I can use Combine Text Tool. I can find it from Insert tab and Combine Text. Once I use this tool, my multiline text are converted into one single multiline text. And it's easy enough to start make changes. But what about those SHX fonts? I can see that right now those are regular AutoCAD drawing objects like polo lines. The good thing is that now I can turn those into regular AutoCAD text objects. First, I select Recognition Settings and I select only TXT font to compare. I hit OK. I select my first area of my text objects. And because it was generated using TXT SHX font, it should be successfully converted into regular AutoCAD text objects. If I hit close, I can see that now I have multiple single line text. And of course, if I want to merge those into one M text area, I can do that by using Combine Text tool again. But what about this Simplex SHX font? If I try to recognize this text using the same tool, select the area and hit Enter, I may get a warning that my text was not recognized. The problem is that I have not included into recognition settings that specific SHX font. If I hit recognition settings again and select simplex or adding some other font I want to recognize, I hit OK again and now selecting the next area I can successfully convert into single line text objects. I can then turn those again into one text area using Combine Text tool. In that way, you can reuse and get most out of your PDF files, including text. If you enjoyed this video and learned new tips and tricks, you are welcome to subscribe to my channel and you are the first to get notified about my new videos. Bye bye!